if you know that you don't want to collect your hair and faint it won't lead to uh 613 the texture will be bad i think it's even safe to say that some factories are wicked hello 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 welcome all back to my channel if you new here hi i'm christiana on this channel we do basically everything business and beauty related videos i know it's been a minute since i spoke with you guys but baby girl is back she's back and she's about to take over i'm about to talk about shopping from vietnam especially if you're trying to go into a business and you're looking forward to buying from vietnam this video is for you if you know that you don't want to collect your hair and faint if not that you don't want customers chasing you left right and center because they delivered bad hairs they are trying to run you over with their cars you don't want customers to be screaming on your head i know what i am saying this particular video is for you i'm making this video based on my past experience actually and what i'm presently experiencing from vietnamese factories so i don't want to keep this to myself i want other people to be aware of what they are going into and all of that please do not mind the drama going back there behind me you know this is not my regular background but this is a struggle for lightning the lightning here is good hence i decided to film here today so guys there are ways you can support this channel right you can like you can subscribe you can comment you can do all of those good stuff and it's absolutely free so why not please share this video so that other amazing women like you like me can actually get to all of it especially if they're going into hair business this video will be super useful to them so guys without further ado let's get right into today's video just like i said earlier today's video is basically for those who are looking forward to buying from vietnam factories you want to go into hair business and you're trying to buy from vietnam this video is for you this video is not regular it's not what you see on a normal day on the streets of youtube people come here on a regular basis telling you about factories telling you about vendors and all of that but Nobody's gonna sit you down to tell you what you're about to experience buying from factories. So I'll be giving you the challenges you might face buying from Vietnam factories and how you can solve it. Yeah, these things ask around, ask for that into the business, they will tell you, <laughs> they will tell you what they are facing buying from all these countries, but today I'm focusing on Vietnam and how you can solve it. And you don't want to miss any part of it because I'll be spilling teas all through. Please, I think it's even safe to say that some factories are wicked. Some Vietnamese factories are wicked. I can tell you for free that some of these factories are scam. Okay, the first thing I would like you to know is that most factories in Vietnam don't sell raw hairs. If you're looking forward to starting your hair brand and you want to sell raw hair, like premium raw hairs, if you're looking forward to sell exquisite strands, see, I would advise that you actually go look into uh, factories from India, from Philippines, and all of that. But only few factories in Vietnam sell raw hairs. See, I'm telling you, I'm giving you the one that I have now, that if you're looking forward to buying raw hairs, you want to sell raw hairs, strictly raw hairs, it's best that you look into uh, factories from Philippines, from India. It's easy to get there than Vietnam. Okay, this video is supposed to be a rant video because presently what I'm experiencing now, God. Moving on, guys. The next thing I'm telling you is that if you're trying to buy from Vietnam, the production date is quite so long. Like sometimes, most time. Most time they don't keep to the time frame. If they tell you that you're gonna get your hair is in two weeks, you're gonna get your hair is in three weeks, guy, it's can actually like it's can actually take them two months to get it done. And I'm putting this out there for those who are open up to uh starting their hair brand based on pre order visits. You don't just go out there telling people that they get their hairs in two weeks, they get it in three weeks, and you get your hairs in three days. Why shopping from Vietnam factory? You're going to disappoint your customers. You sure are going to disappoint your customers. So if you're looking forward to uh, starting your hair brand based on pre-order, I'm just about to tell you now, or I'm telling you now that factories don't keep to time frame, especially Vietnamese factories. Moving on, guys. Another thing I would like you to put in mind is that you can't lead the hairs to six one three. If you're buying virgin hairs, if you're buying um, Remy hairs, if you're buying double drawn hairs they will tell you that 
it, it can't lift up to 613 only their raw hairs do lift to 613 and just like i said factories that sell raw hairs are scarce so they can actually tell you that the hair, the hair is <laughs> they can actually tell you that the hair is raw hair and eventually it won't lift to uh, 613 the texture will be bad the quality will be less to be nothing to write home about so just put in mind that those categories of hair in vietnam can't be bleached to 613 double drawn virgin hairs and their um remy hairs most of the hairs that these factories sell are non-remy hairs you can go through your google as a as, as a air vendor you have to actually do your own research about um hairs on a regular basis to keep you updated and all of that finally guys what i want you to take notes if you're buying from vietnam is the shipping period just like factories with delay shipping companies too with delay i don't know like it's just so tiring and so frustrating i don't know why people don't keep to time i don't know why they feel like they can just do whatever they feel like after they collect the money that's actually tiring and i i don't even know how to deal with all this kind of stuff but let me just tell you that if you're buying from vietnam and you're trying to ship through cargo all these mr Gabriel and all of that put in mind that those people take time to deliver just like i said guys that i'll be giving you solutions to all of these problems so i'll be giving you four solutions to all of these problems i mentioned earlier the first thing i'm talking about is you should make sure that it's already sourced for your contact before going into a business you don't just go about buying ten thousand contacts for one dollar and start doing try and error with your money or with customers money make sure that it's already sourced for air vendors especially if you're trying to start on a good note you want to start with premium hairs and let me give you one tip good hair market itself when people see it on your customers when they see it on your clients they ask them where they get the hairs from when people see it on the ground it abstracts them good hairs sell itself so if you want to start on a good note you want to start with premium hairs only make sure that you totally invest your energy in sourcing for vendors do your research ask people that sell quality hairs that, that are willing to share their contacts buy from them so a thorough search for supplier from vietnam actually save you all of the stress moving on guys the next thing i'm talking about is make sure that your hairs are available before you start marketing it is best to have your hairs available before you start marketing it will save you a lot of stress of customers asking you when they will get their hairs it will save you a lot of stress of um calling factories to be fast with their production calling shipping agents and all of that if you have your hairs available like that will even make it easy for you to focus on just marketing and it will make the whole process seamless moving on you don't have the money to buy in bulk from vietnam you don't have the money to make the heads available before you start marketing and you want to go on a period route make sure that you give your customers a very long period of time like a week extra to what the, the factory give you if everything you've calculated for production and shipping is one month add a week to it making it five weeks and let me give you the tea right people will actually wait in three months four months so far they know that they're getting quality from you they wouldn't mind so there's no point trying to tell them that they get their hairs in two weeks in, in seven days when you know that factory is not even be done with it in in two weeks so give them that time frame it's actually a lot of stress of customers calling you asking you when um they will get their hairs so the final tip i'm telling you is if you want to boycott these uh cargo shipments and all of that the way you can do it is to register with dhl i know for this to work in nigeria it's going to work in other countries so far dhl is in your country and you have your business uh registered just go to their website and fill in form to be um like in partnership with them these actually reduce the, the prices they charge imported goods and if you want to make use of them domestically too it will reduce the price like basically if you want to send goods within the country in nigeria through dhl it will cost you five dollars but as for me who is a registered member i will not pay anything higher than two thousand naira. even if i'm sending to the north from my place to another place like neighboring neighboring state is like one three so you can see the difference between one three and five thousand naira, and that is the same thing that will apply when you're importing goods too just make sure that you, you tell them to to create like an import account for you you'll be getting like 30 percent off the normal regular price or 50 percent off the 
regular price so and that is all i'll be telling you as regards the problem you about you might face and i've given you solutions to that with this we come to the end of today's video guys if you actually enjoy this video and you feel like it's useful make sure that you sh you share this video comments below let me know your struggles shopping from factories let me know what you're facing like and if you are not subscribed to this channel already please kindly subscribe to this channel if you're looking forward to starting your air brand and you're looking for shipping agents the link will be in the description box of this video if you want to join luxury sellers um community luxury in a box the link will be in there in this video see you in my next video bye